Hey, Mark Nelson here. Today what I want to do is share with you how to make a video using your smartphone. Now, I don't know if you've done videos before. When I first started, the only thing I had was my MacBook or my PC. And I just used the document camera, not the document camera, but the camera on my computer. In fact, I'm doing it right now. Uh, I'm a teacher. So in between my classes, I can make a video really quick on my computer. But I usually use my phone. One, it actually has a better camera. But today what I want to do is just go over some really basics because I, I think some people, many people, get such a fear of this that they're kind of nervous to do anything. To tell you the truth, nowadays, your phone is probably has one of the best cameras that you can be using. So how do you make a video using one of these? And I have an iPhone. Um, that's my wife on there. That's pretty cool, huh? <laughs> but that's all I use. So my first tip is when you're doing it, right? What I do is I make sure I'm shooting horizontally, not vertically. I know people do it, but you know, when you do it horizontally, you get this widescreen, much more like what you're seeing right now. If you do it vertically, you get those little black screens on there. And to me, or, or kind of gray screens. And to me, that just doesn't look good. I know if you're doing Instagram, you almost have to do this unless you have an editing machine. But what I do is make sure I go horizontal. The second thing, what, the biggest thing you need is lighting. Now, when I first started shooting my videos, one, I use my phone outside a lot. That's kind of where I use it. But make sure the light is behind you, not in front of you. Now, I don't have a window here, but I have good lights here, so I have pretty good lighting. And then you actually need some tools. One, sometimes when you're doing a video, if the lighting isn't okay, it's it, but your audio is good, people are still going to catch it. They're still going to listen to it. So I use... Uh, lapel mic. This is a uh, Rode lapel mic and it picks up sound really easily. You know, I dropped it as so I put it back on. Uh, and I'll put a link down below for you to pick one up. I use, this is just a small little tripod that I use if I'm using because I do use my phone in here too also. I have a selfie stick. I can use this as a selfie stick, but I have a selfie stick and I actually have one that's called a Smooth. And a smooth is one that has a gimbal inside it, so you can, as you're walking, it kind of stays right in your face. But those are really all I th all you have. So when you shoot videos on your phone, one, horizontally. There's a lens. Now, in my camera right there, that's my lens. I look in that, much like I look in my computer screen. Look at the lens. Don't look at the screen because you're going to be looking away. Look at the lens, and the people are going to be, thinking you're looking and talking directly to them. Now, if you don't have a steady arm, and I have a challenge with that once in a while, so that's why I bring in my selfie stick, and I'll hold that selfie stick really tight. That's why I got one of those things with a gimbal, because gimbal control so that they can kind of move up and down. They keep focused on me, because I kind of get, uh, I'll get, not, I don't want to say I'm trembling, because I'm not trembling. It's just I get shaky. You know, I don't hold that camera steady. And that's really hard, and that's a, a trick. And some people taught me, you got to keep your elbow straight. But that's kind of the way it goes. So horizontal. Look in the lens, not on the screen. Talk loudly. Use, there it is, use a, a microphone if you need one, and I suggest using one. I'll put the link below in the description for that. Uh, tripod, if you're sitting still. Selfie stick, if you're moving. And if you can afford one of the, they aren't very expensive, they're like 90 bucks right now, uh, to one of those uh, gimbal machines. And there are different brands, and I'll put one in the link down below for you there too. So that's it. Go shoot a video. Now remember, when you're shooting a video, guess what? You are the expert. So you tell them what they need to know. Now, if you got any value from this, here's what I'd like you to do. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, just give me something. Give me a, a comment that if you liked it or not, share it with your friends, hit that subscribe button and hit that little bell because I'm going to do videos all the time. I like doing them during, uh, during the day. That's the best works for me. So give me a like, comment, share. 
hit that subscribe button. Ha, ah, I fooled you, didn't I? And then, guess what? I'm going to have a couple links down below. One for a couple uh, accessories you can use and another for a way for you to learn how to make money online. You take care.